Hi, my name is Taylor Martin from Embry-Riddle Aeronautical University, and the project that we are currently working on is an air combat training paradigm for the Navy called Live Virtual Constructive Training, or otherwise known as LVC training. LVC combines a live pilot up in the air with a pilot on the ground in a simulator, as well as a computer-generated track all into one training exercise. More specifically, we are focused on hazard assessment and mitigation for LBC. Currently, there are procedures, training rules, standards, and naval aviation culture together that make up current safety systems. Implementation of LBC will likely require modifications to that safety system. 20 potential hazards were identified in accordance with the operational risk management process. ORM is a systematic, cyclical process that consists of five steps. Thus far, we have completed the first two steps of the round of this repeatable process, the identification of hazards and hazard assessment using severity and probability scales. In the future, risk decisions will need to be made, controls will be implemented, and supervision, including hazard monitoring and feedback, will occur. The 20 identified hazards were assessed using the severity and probability scales of the ORM system. Two researchers rated severity and probability for each hazard, and their reconciled ratings were plotted on the risk assessment matrix shown here to obtain a risk assessment code. Efforts must be made to mitigate the 20 identified potential hazards, which fall into seven overall categories. Of particular concern are the four hazards shown. These hazards require additional safety and system design guidance, as there are gaps in the existing guidance. There are many aspects of training that will change the incorporation of LVC technology. With these changes in training comes potential benefits as well as possible hazardous situations. One example of a common training scenario that could be modified due to LVC is a simulation of a kill removal during an exercise. Currently without LVC, when an adversary is shot down, the adversary pilot then has to maneuver the aircraft out of the exercise without causing problems. With the incorporation of LVC technology, Virtual or constructive adversaries can realistically simulate a kill removal by disappearing off the radar and not interfering with the exercise. Consequently, there are still possible hazards for this new training scenario involving LVC. Due to the fact that there are other reasons why live aircraft could disappear off the radar, such as accidents or maneuvering, using LVC to simulate realistic kill removal could possibly create additional safety concerns. Thus, further research is needed to determine the safest and most effective method of kill removal. Further planned iterations of the ORM process could result in the revelation of new possible hazards, the expansion of current hazards, and the mitigation of possible hazards through the development of additional safety and system design guidance.